two years ago, I was not the best version of myself and she completely got me on the right track. She's like my teammate, best friend. And I'm just really excited to finally marry the love of my life. My parents are like the most supportive people. We get along so well, we're so close. I love the relationship I have with my parents. It's the same one I want with my children. My dad is my best friend. He always has been. We've had the closest relationship our whole life. Any dream I had would say would let me go for it. He's just a really good dad. She means a lot to me. We've had a love-hate kind of relationship, but we're always best friends. I guess that's how most brother-sister relationships are. No matter if we're fighting, we'll always be there for each other. He's the best guy I've ever met. The most generous, selfless, amazing guy. He's the smartest guy I know, and he loves me no matter what. He's just my dream guy. What does your sister mean to you? The world. She's my everything. My best friend also. She's like half of me. Like my other half. My mom, there's no one like her. She thinks she knows best and most of the time she does because she's always been right when I've made my mistakes and we always laugh about that. And I just love her so much and I want to thank her so much for throwing this wedding for me and I can't wait for the party tomorrow to celebrate with her. I love you and I cannot wait to celebrate with you and our family. I can't wait to be your wife, just create memories and have the best life together. Grandma and me are extremely fortunate to be here today to celebrate with you. We wish you the best and many happy years of marriage and children to keep you young and tired. V, I love you. You make me the happiest person in the world. You've made me such a better person. I don't even know how to thank you. I'll just be thanking you the rest of my life forever. I love you. So we met online during COVID at the beginning and we talked for a few months. I was always begging her to come over. She said no. She wouldn't even FaceTime me so I didn't know if she was going to be who she said she was or what her pictures looked like. Then eventually she showed up at my door and I was like in shock how pretty she was. We just connected. We had the best time together and after that I like moved in the next day and we've just been together ever since then. I'm just looking forward to finally being married. I'm just looking to enjoy the moment as best I can with friends and family. And for the first time, I would like to introduce the bride and groom, Dylan and Vic! Today is a day grandmothers and grandfathers look forward to seeing their children wed and move out of the house. Charlotte and me hope 
that Victoria and Dylan will beat our 63 years of marriage.